Mrs. Sushi, your dose, was going to help you to score the maximum marks in the coming exam. So if you can see in today's video, we are going to discuss about the important questions from the chapter Electric Charges and Fields, which is your PU2 chapter, that's the second PUC chapter. Now you must be thinking why am I discussing about this chapter but if you have watched my previous video you will know why this chapter electric charges and fields is an important chapter to us. So in case students if you have missed to watch my previous video do go and watch it and you will know why am I discussing about this chapter. So you can see that I have written few important questions from this chapter. So basically if I have to say it is only the creamy layer of questions from this chapter guys i have told you that this chapter is very important for five marks and i'm sure five plus marks will come from this chapter you will score above five marks surely from this chapter so let's begin the first question that is coulomb's law so you can see that coulomb's law was asked in the year march 2017 for one mark so this is one of the important question that was asked in the year march 2017 for one mark the next question coulomb's law in vector form this is very very important question this question was asked in the year march 2016 and july 2015 for two marks you can see that this question was asked two times that is march 2016 and july 2015 for two marks the next question that is expression for electric field at a point on the axis of an e electric dipole okay on the axis of an electric dipole this is an important question or they can also ask derive an expression for electric field on the axial line this question is very very important for five marks and this question had appeared in the year march 2016 and july 2018 for five marks that is what i was talking about this chapter usually they will ask one derivation for sure so you can see that march 2016 and july 2018 this question was asked for five marks and now if you observe march 2016 you had five marks in your pocket march 2016 you had two marks in your pocket so totally you have scored seven marks from this chapter so guys that is what i was stressing this chapter is very very important and surely you will score more than five marks from this chapter believe me you will score we'll go to the next question expression for electric field at a point on the equatorial line of an electric dipole this is also one of the important question and this question had been appeared on the paper in the year march 2015 for five marks again an important question which had been come in the paper the next question expression for electric field at a point due to an infinite long straight uniformly charged wire very very important question and this question had been in the year july 2015 july 2016 for five marks you can see that both the year in the supplementary 15 and 16 this question had appeared for five marks the next question expression for electric field due to an uniformly charged infinite plane sheet this question they haven't asked yet in the annual exam but you cannot take a chance you cannot say that okay this question has been never asked in the exam so i will not study that cannot happen you have to study this question you have to study this question this question is very 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 important because they can ask you this question for how much five marks that's what i've said to you they can ask this question for five marks which is very very important and you cannot take any chance you cannot take any chance so please do study this question because they have not asked any year so there are chances that this question can appear in the year 2019 in your paper the next question expression for electric field at any point due to a charged spherical shell this question had been appeared in the paper in the year july 2014 march 2014 and july 2018 for five marks so these questions had come in the annual exam for five marks now guys please pay attention the questions that is question number three question number four question number five question number six question number seven you cannot take any chance you cannot skip this questions from this chapter at any cost you need to be thorough with these one two three four five these 
five questions at any cost you need to know them you have to be thorough with these questions because these questions are very very important very important because out of these questions any one question will surely come in your board exams now again if you have paid attention you can see that none of the question had come from march 2018 none of the questions you can see from this chapter in the year march 2018 now what had happened please listen to me in the year march 2018 from this chapter they had asked one numerical what did they do they asked a numerical so if you have seen my previous video i have correctly told you from chapter number one or chapter number two either they can ask you a numerical or they can ask a derivation and in the year 2018 they had asked the derivation from the second chapter so that is what i said to you that's what i told you if you study these two chapters you will surely get above 10 marks 100 percent so guys pay attention it is important this chapter will help you to score above five marks for sure but you need to be thorough with these questions that is expression for electric field on the actual line equatorial line and the applications of gauss law very very important and again i'm stressing and saying i have just spoken about the creamy layer of this question that's only the creamy layer you need to go through depth you need to concentrate you need to work hard you need to take your responsibilities and go in depth with this chapter and complete everything because you concentrate on these chapters you will show surely score above 80 in physics so if you have loved the video please like it share it with your friends so that it can help them out and in case you have any kind of doubts please do comment do try to connect to me ask me anything you want any help will be always there for you all take care do well and all the best